um, <clears throat> in many areas of the country, there are now popping up uh, centers of excellence with, with cancer care. Um, I can't think of many areas of the country where there aren't within about three to five uh, hour radius really great hospitals that are providing quality cancer care. So get out there, use the internet, Google a little bit and figure out what the closest one is to you um, because more than likely there will be. <clears throat> Another great option to use with social media um, is reaching out to your friends and family and say, listen, you know, who out there has had experience with a, with a local cancer center of excellence? You know, what, what are your experiences with this doctor, that doctor? Uh, what are your recommendations? And uh, this is really turning out to be a fantastic way to, um, to, to gut check and, and level set with a lot of doctors and, and, and get a good indication about what you should be expecting when you go into there to visit with them. Um, <clears throat> I personally have recommended a lot of doctors on social media and, and also provide us some feedback on social media that says this doctor might not be the best choice for you based on this and what I experienced. Uh, there's a number of other doctor rating sites and then greatmydoc.com. Um, in, in an age where you can go out and say whatever you want on, you know, online, you can get a whole lot of feedback that may or may not be your, your own experience when you go visit with this doctor, but you can certainly get a good consensus uh, when you're out there researching a doctor that you're considering or a research institution that you're considering as well. Um, in this case, what is the most convenient might not be what is best for you. Um, there may be a, a local oncologist who is 10 minutes away where a center of excellence may be three hours away. Um, do consider getting a second opinion at the Center of Excellence. I have dealt with many situations where um, local oncologists don't always have um, the most up-to-date research, in some cases not the most up-to-date facilities um, or treatment, of it, uh, treatment options um, as a, a, a large cancer center of excellence might. So just because it's closed doesn't mean it's the best option for you. So, so do obviously consider um, looking at multiple locations, even if it will be a little bit more inconvenient for you to get there. 